So in this video, you'll learn how to screen record on your Samsung Galaxy S25. So for this video, I'll be using the S25 Ultra, but these instructions will apply across all the S25 phones. So the first step when it comes to screen recording is to access the quick settings menu. And to do that, just swipe down and then swipe down again to access the quick settings menu. And then from here, you should see the option screen recorder. If you don't find it here, then just tap on this edit icon, tap on edit quick settings, then look for it down here, select it and add it to the menu, then just tap on done, and then select done again. And once you've finished with all of that, you should see the screen recording icon. So once you've located the icon, just tap on it, and then it will prompt you to choose how you want to record sound. So you can choose none, you can choose media, and you can choose media and mic. And if you have a wireless microphone or a Bluetooth microphone or any type of microphone that you have connected to your S25, then you'll be able to select that mic as your default mic. Then you also have the option of showing any taps and touches that you're going to be making on the screen. So you can choose to enable or disable it completely up to you. So once you've customized how you're going to be recording your screen, just tap on start recording and then a countdown will appear. You can choose to skip it or not. It's completely up to you. Then once you've done that, your screen record, your phone will start being recorded. So every action that you're doing, whether it's opening apps, closing apps, make a uh, texting or something similar your phone screen will be recorded so at the top you should see this toolbar that allows you to do even more functions when you're recording your screen so you have the option of tapping on this icon here and then you can start drawing on your screen whatever it is you want again it will still be recorded onto the screen recorder you can choose to change the color by tapping on this color icon selecting a different color as well as the opacity and the thickness of the color again completely up to you if you want to erase it just tap on this undo button here and then it will erase what's currently on your screen you can go even further by choosing to use this selfie camera option so you can just tap on it and then you have this selfie camera menu at the top appearing so it will record your face at the same time as you're recording your screen and then you can go even further if you want to remove that camera option just tap on that icon again and it will remove the selfie camera then you also have this play pause, and stop icons here as well as the timer for how long the screen recording is going so currently my recording is already at 1 minute and 25 seconds if i want to pause it i can just tap on pause and then do whatever it is you want to do whether it's something personal and you don't want the recording to catch it or it's a phone call just something you don't want to record it you can just tap on pause finish up what you're doing and then tap on start again to continue recording if you're ready to stop your screen recording just tap on this stop icon here and then your screen recording will be saved to your gallery app so open gallery and then you should see your screen recording and then you can just tap on play and your screen recording will now be played so everything that i previously did you'll see happening on this screen recording and so that's how you can record the screen of your Galaxy S25. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and we'll get back to you.